Hi, I'm Veronica with WatchMojo.com, and today we're learning what to do, what to avoid, so that you can get that flat stomach we all want. So is it possible for everyone to have a flat stomach? I think so. I think uh, everyone can get a flat stomach. It's going to take time, hard work. If you've taken 10 years to, to put on the weight, it's going to take more than two weeks to take it off. Is the secret to chiseled abs just sit-ups and crunches? No, you're going to have to do a variety of exercises, lots of different directions. Side bending, flexion from lower, from upper, rotation and twisting, as well diet is going to be very important. So now you're going to take me through an ab workout, right? Yeah, let's go show you. I've got some advanced moves for you. Okay. Okay, so we'll try and do a little around the world exercise. Uh, Max has a heavier ball and uh, Veronica with a lighter one. And uh, this is just a good little warm up for your abs. So we'll start from one hip. We're gonna go around, up overhead, and to the other hip. And then back, return, and that's one repetition. We'll try and do 12 of these. Okay, so we've got two versions here of a, a combination move. We're gonna do, the harder version is a deadlift, and then roll out, and bring the bar back. And the easier version is going to be from the knees, rolling out, and bringing the bar back. So when Max does the deadlift, the back is bracing, the abs are bracing, and then as he rolls out here, the abs are going to be working very hard to bring this bar back, and then lift again. Veronica is going to grab the bar and roll out into a lengthened position where the abs are long, and then use the abs to contract and bring the bar back. Good. We'll do 12 repetitions of this one. Okay, so we're going to work the lower abs now. So we'll be under the bar. Lifting the bar in the air, holding it up, trying to touch your feet to the side of the squat rack, then the other side of the squat rack. Okay, up and down. Try not to bang the bar here or here. You're gonna try to keep the bar very steady. Bring the feet all the way down and touch the squat rack over there, all the way down. Now the very low position can be hard on the back, so if it is, when you bring your feet up, touch the side, bend your knees when you come down. It'll be a little bit easier on the back. To make it easier, we can lighten the load. Alright, now try to touch your feet up here, both feet together, that's it, and then knees bent, come down, and feet up there. Good. Try to keep that bar steady. Try to touch the floor and touch the squat rack. Okay, so we're going to do a little combination move where Max is going to be working his abs, bringing his legs over Veronica. Veronica's going to be working her back with the bent over rope. So an easier version of the legs over a person is just going to be a knee tuck here on this side. Try not to swing. That's it. Good. Okay, we're going to do some crunches on the BOSU using a resistance band. Uh, Max is going to hold the handles here. I'm going to anchor the band. And we'll have him do a few crunches. Sitting just a little bit front of center on the BOSU. And then once he's done his 20 repetitions, we're going to ask him to hold halfway up and I'll put some resistance in a few different directions here. He's trying to keep his feet down while I pull in different directions. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a lighter resistance band here for Veronica. And we'll do the same routine, 20 sit-ups, and then try to hold for a few um, pulls in different directions. Okay, so Max is gonna put his hands down. He's gonna try to bring his legs up to one side and then across to the other side. Good. Keeping good control, trying to work the abs hard here. Okay, Veronica's gonna show us an easier version where she's gonna try to tuck her knees to one side and then the other side. That's it. Try to keep the abs tight and nice and high here. Good. Making sure to always keep your feet together. Okay, so for a more advanced version, you can go right up onto one hand. So trying to bring the feet together onto one hand, onto the other hand. 